every time you sleep with someone you leave a part of your soul energy with them make yourself so gorgeous so amazing so beautiful so attractive that you know people get pulled to you rather than you chasing if the only reason you're with someone is physical needs eventually you will feel used abused and your soul will start to diminish Two months ago my breakup is done so now I'm feeling like to have that touchy thing the physical relationship so would that be okay to go to that ex boyfriend or somebody else or what can I do You know what whenever we allow for our physicality to be catered to before our emotional needs we can land up feeling used abused and just generally cheap So you want to be really careful around um while I'm very I want to honor your physical needs I want you to know that as a woman we are very capable of pleasuring ourselves so I don't see why you need to refrain from that yeah the fact that you feel like you need a man to complete you in any way whether it's emotionally mentally or physically will actually land up attracting the wrong people in your life because you'll go for your needs rather than what you deserve So I'd love for you to grow yourself into becoming this person where we are able to you know they say the more evolved you get the more in control you get of all your needs whether it is hunger whether it is your emotional needs whether it is your physical needs whether it is your all of the sins are actually needs that as we evolve from what is the difference between an animal and a human being an animal cannot evolve from his needs but we can and you know what the beauty is for women we can do so many things to explore ourselves i'd love for you to follow um planet bb she is amazing i'd love for you to follow mama gina i'd love for you to follow all of these gorgeous women who teach us how we are so complete on our own and the only time we should allow for someone to come into our life is when they can honor us the same way that you know we deserve to be honored because can i tell you something when we sleep with someone who doesn't love us or doesn't value us every time you sleep with someone you leave a part of your soul energy with them and if it was not reciprocated with the same love or the same and it is just only a physical exchange it actually reduces our aura and so you don't want to reduce your aura my sweetheart you really want to become that person who's only with someone when you are valued even if you go back to your ex and you get pleasure for a couple of months i can tell you at the end of those months you're not going to be left feeling better and imagine if he starts to date in the meantime or he starts to engage with other people the more of all of that you will entertain the more you will start to fall in your own eyes and you will start to reduce your standards and adjust to whatever you get and i think that's one of the biggest mistakes we make as women because you know what we are so precious and i don't want to give you any moral lecture here this is not about morality at all but even if you start to understand this conversation spiritually i feel like it will be very helpful for you so my suggestion make yourself so gorgeous so amazing so beautiful so attractive that you know people get pulled to you rather than you chasing you know i remember there was this scene where oprah speaks about how her boyfriend was leaving the house and her ex boyfriend and she had written some letter to him or something and from the fireplace she held on to his leg and he dragged her till the door and then he slammed the door on her face and left and she cried and cried and cried and she looks back at that scene and says at what to what level had i dropped my dignity you know that i allowed a person to treat me in that manner and so i feel like all of us at some point have killed ourselves by loving someone else more than what we love ourselves and i think the biggest or the most beautiful journey we can go on as women especially is the fact to love ourselves at least equally if not more to the person that we want to be loved by you know do not give anyone the open gate to love you if they don't value or respect you first and i think that's again i don't want to sound moral wise or preachy or you know i just want you to know that there's no way you can come out of that a winner that for your physical needs 
if the only reason you're with someone is physical needs eventually you will feel used abused and your soul will start to diminish i would rather you hold yourself to that level where you go you know what i deserve better and honestly if you were my daughter i would have said the same thing to you so i'm just giving you advice not so much as a life coach today but as a mother who i don't have my own daughter so for me all of you are like that this is what i would say to my boys or to you that you know what don't get into anything where you are not first valued and loved that's where we need to start god bless you sending you lots of positive energy